Abdus Salam was born in 1952 in Washington, D.C., one of seven children in a poor family and attended the public schools there. She was a 1974 graduate of Barnard College and a 1977 graduate of Columbia Law School. Abdus Salam was the first female black judge in New York's Court of Appeals. As well as being the first Muslim to serve on the bench, Abdus Salam became the first black female to be on the New York Court of Appeals after her 2013 appointment, according to State Senator Kevin Parker. Before joining the Court of Appeals, Abdus Salam, first served as a judge in the New York City Civil Court in 1992. Abdus Salam was confirmed without any opposition. Abdus Salam was inspired to become a lawyer as a child after meeting civil rights icon Frankie Muse Freeman. Her interest in the law began with TV shows such as A Perry Mason. However, it was only after meeting still living civil rights lawyer, Frankie Muse Freeman, while Abdus Salam was still at high school that law school beckoned. Abdus Salam said of the meeting, she was riveting. She was doing what I wanted to do, using the law to help people. Abdus Salam, who later referred to a career in law as God's work, graduated from Barnard College in 1974 and received her law degree from Columbia three years later. In 1980, Abdus Salam began her career in government when she became an assistant attorney general in the New York State Department of Law, Civil Rights and real estate financing bureaus. While on the Supreme Court, Salam was known for opposing liquor licenses. Seymour W. James Jr., the attorney-in-chief of the Legal Aid Society, the nation's largest provider of free legal services, said he had first met Judge Abdus Salam in the early 1980s, when she worked at the Civil Rights Bureau. Mr. James said her upbringing and years spent representing the poor and disenfranchised had shaped her perspective on the bench. She was a strong believer in equal rights and equal access to justice, he said in an interview. In an interview in 2014 about black history, Judge Abdus Salam said that she had become interested in her family's history as a young girl in public school and that her research had led her to discover that her great-grandfather was a slave in Virginia, Virginia, 